Hello everybody, welcome to Nelly's Nook. My name is Nelly and today I will be sharing with you how to do multi-layered photo strip book fold. Um, I will be folding this pattern and my I will have three layers on this pattern. My first layer will be first frame. This one will be my second layer. This this little frame. And then inside I will have this beautiful rose. Uh, the layers that I started are one centimeters apart. It will be one centimeter apart and the depth. So you can do half a centimeter, you can do depth, whatever you are comfortable with or whatever you like. At the beginning right now, what I have done is the first layer. That's the beginning of the frame over here. You can see my black frame is here and the blue part. When I start to hit the brown color, which is here, then I will be uh, dividing this in two different layers, which I will which I will show you. What we will need for this fold is our pattern, which will look, pages will look like this. They will be probably longer, but this is for my other project. And um, on each, each page, we need to cut uh, strips. So the strips will be cut this way. Each page, what I do, I usually cut my whole pattern and Put them together with the paper paper clip so i can just pull one um, stack little stack and uh, i know that this is my one pa one page when i have those strips done then i will fold them in half and numerically put them in line so it's easier for me to go one by one when i'm putting them in the book so now we will need also something to hold your book um, depends what you like you can put your phone on on your book you can use clips to hold your book or if you have a stand or anything like that you can have a book like this to hold now uh, just because it's a layered we will need to crease and marked the depth of the of the layers you can do it with your pencil and mark with the pencil every single page uh, make sure that the book is nice nice and even uh, and you can mark it one centimeter each or you can mark it half a centimeter each whatever uh, whatever you like I think I will mark it half a centimeter, half a centimeter each. So you can mark each page with a pencil. And then score it. But what I like to do, I take a pen, I take my ruler, and I mark it with a pen. So I mark half a centimeter here and I mark half a centimeter there let's put on the bottom half a centimeter here and half a centimeter there And you can see that I already marked multiple pages over here, so I don't have to mark every single page. Now I will check it again. If it's still correct, I'll keep going. If it's not, I will just adjust it. This one is still correct. So half a centimeter here. centimeter this way I saved a lot of 
a lot of time on on marking all the pages and you can see i have 10 probably 15 pages done right away so i'll do that until the end end of the book when everything is marked you take your ruler and those quarter lines where you marked your points and you can do it with a scoring tool and we'll just mark it here or if you have any any other tools oops i got stuck over there And you can see I have two scoring score line. So I'll do another one. One. Two. So this strip does not have um, two layers yet. We are still in the uh, beginning of the frame right here. So I have just the blue and black frame. So what we will do, we will just cut the strip. Make sure that your number is matching. We'll strip, cut the strip over the... pattern starts on this page I did not have to score I just wanted to show you what we will do make sure that you align it properly press it in and cut it where the page ends I like to cut it after then I apply the strip so I know I everything is just perfect okay next one we still have only two, uh, two one, one layer and you can see this second layer is just coming in so this one will be again just one layer we'll attach this one in make sure it's nicely aligned push it in For the next strip, I can see the brown will be here. So the brown is starting my frame. So that will be a second layer already. So I have it scored, so I know where my layers will be. I'll cut the strip. Make sure it matches your um, page and put uh, the tape right at the edge. Because we will be cutting, we will be cutting the layer now. So adjust it. Make sure you press it in. We cut the bottom, and now we will be cutting the second layer, just to the fold, and that's exactly half a centimeter. Now we will fold this part and we apply the tape again on this part. Oops. Now we will do the same thing. We will just attach it to our strip. Make sure it's right in there. Press it in. And that's our second layer. 
that will be our second layer so now i just have to score again because it's all marked the marking that i do it's pretty it's pretty fast i like to do it this way i don't like to go through every page and mark it with a pencil okay we have our next strip we will put the tape on the edges not in the middle because we will be cutting it out And let's cut the layer. You can see how nicely it comes off. We will fold it in half. Oops. Apply, apply the tape again. My tape is getting sticky. Apply our strip. Make sure you push it in, press on the tape, and here's our page. So we will do this frame until we will get to the third layer. Thank you. 